Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got so trouble, 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 trouble. Ask my carrier, this long distance, like T-Mobile Y'all on that sprint shit, don't make me pull up the niggas you dip with Get a casket, see if you can fit in this house, gonna work out huh? When the homies don't want me to murk out They don't dumb shit as soon as the word out I got through bread, comes all these birds out In the gas wars, then I swerve out uh, The nerve of these niggas make me nervous A nigga knock a nerve out uh. yeah. Trouble, 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 trouble you already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Follow me on IG, Vada underscore fly. Tell your mama I said hi. Like, comment on the video, subscribe, watch some old joints. There's a lot of things to talk about. But I want to first get started with a salute to none other than K Shine. I did a blog on him yesterday called Six Reasons Why the URL Needs K Shine Back ASAP. You know what I mean? I try to switch it up, do some more topics. I know y'all love the news and the recaps too, but we're expanding the portfolio. I've, I did topics before and I'm going to continue to do them. But uh, he said they took the demands literal. Laugh my A off. Bro, I would never say what I really want on the internet. Y'all crazy blog people go for anything. On a serious note, though, salute to Vada Fly. He was right on point, though. And I just named all of the reasons why they need him back ASAP. You should go back. If you didn't see that blog yesterday, go back and peep that joint. Drop a comment. Let me know how you feel about that. And then uh, yesterday, obviously, Sue Surf. He joined the spaces. He talked about he's the black captain. He said everything. And burn. <laughs> and you know it's serious because he put the Times New Roman font on there. It made a Microsoft Word statement. He got on the computer and got his type on. As of today, I, as a black captain, will no longer be associated nor label myself as a member of gun titles. Say, blah, 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 blah. Who wrote that? Your girlfriend? Surf, they need you. They need you. Your team needs you right now. I'm going through real life shit. And I pray the best for you and the best with you. But right now, Yo squad is down. They looking crazy over there. Come on, rocket, sir. What will we lose? He submits his resignation. It's a cloud move, you know what I mean? Like, think about it. If you was breaking up with your girlfriend, you don't go to Instagram and say, I'm single. You won't pull up and tell her, yo, I don't want to be here no more. If you resigning from your job, you're not gonna go on Instagram and say I no longer work at McDonald's, you're gonna walk up to McDonald's and say I quit. The fact that mm -hmm. you choose to the fact that you choose to give it to social media before you hit rock. Or before you hit surf, it showed that you're doing it for a clout. Everything he does is calculated at this point. There's a reason why it was dropped at the timing that it was dropped. Easy to block, Captain. The algorithm king leaves gun titles in the middle of URL's face-offs. What the? Jesus, send the flood. You just want to be in the algorithms, man. It makes more of a story with you saying it to the internet than you just shooting me a text because you got me on the app. So instead of you texting me and saying it, or you texting Rock and saying it, in reality, it'll create... How you feel? But Easy the Black Captain did respond to Sue Surf yesterday on his live stream. With Ro I feel like anybody who's rocking for the niggas who's trying to tear me down can't be an associate to me. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Can we be, like, cordial off this shit? Yeah, it means battle rap. Right. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, we all know what these niggas is trying to do. Right. We know what these niggas is trying to do. So everybody, everybody who's siding with them to me is approving that shit. So my thing is if you're approving that shit or you siding with like then it's like we there's no need for us to be cool at all. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? So you know that is on his channel. You can go see that there. I believe it's on the subscriber joint, but then he usually releases it the next day. It's a recap of the trenches, and um, he spoke on that. But what he did say, you know, I got to, I can paraphrase and tell you what my thought process is, and I'll give you a little bit more of why he left and why he doesn't really need gun titles. You know what I'm saying? Like he really did not need that faction anymore. So first and foremost, uh, he explained that nobody from there was able to support him anymore. They couldn't, they wasn't gonna share his flyer. It wasn't gonna- Yo, man. make the shot now, Mr. Mitch. Make the Yo, shot man, now, baby. That's off, Mitch. Mitch, make it with the count, make it with the count. Ah, nigga, that's off. Give me my money. Give me my money. 
Give me my money. Come on, right man. here, man. I ain't got it right now, man. You ain't got it. No ribs. Nah, come on, B. No ribs, no rice, no champagne. You don't eat nothing. <laughs> Fuck you, man. I'll get my money, man. Pay my money, man. Yo, hey, man. Just loan me 10 G's Thank real fast. Let so your I man. get back to the crib. Don't your man 10 G's because I ain't giving him his food back. Or nothing like that. Now, did he need it? I mean, the event was still successful, the trenches, even though, you know, the organization you were always trying to sabotage it. They were threatening battlers, pulling people off the card. Danny Myers, my whole life is in jeopardy without Alex Trebek. And after a while, it just became too much of a messy situation. And when it comes to like URL and like everybody else, they choose their side of the street, you choose yours. There's no division here. There's no, oh, we can kind of be cool and yada, yada, yada. That's why the people who are affiliated with them will not really support that event, are not going to go to Easy to Block Captain's event, is not going to be pushing the VOD, pushing the trailer, pushing the... But they're not going to do that because they are aligned with someone else. That's just the way it goes. And Easy has to realize that too at the same time. When you choose your side, and I'm sure he knows this, because I mean, I've spoken to him about this. When you choose your side, that's it. It is what it is. Everything else that comes from the other side, you can't expect anything no more. Yes, it's corny and pitiful that these niggas are not easy, but the battle rap leagues and URL tries to treat regular folks conducting business like ops. Oh, the ops. I told you, I was told. I would, I'd be like, bro, I'm here for battle rap. I'm not here for y'all corny beefs. Like, I don't give a fuck about nothing y'all got going on over here. I'm going to go to this event. I'm going to go to that event. I'm going to go to King of Dot event. I'm going to go to Croak 23. I'm going to go And we're going to get to that, too, because that messed up a lot of my relationships because I was such a great flexer. People thought I had money before I had it, but let, we'll get back to oh, that. Yeah. But I, I once I got the Rolex, and I was like, yo, this is crazy. Now Everywhere, because I'm here for a battle rap. I'm not here for a URL. I don't got a URL jacket. Remy got me one. I don't got a URL jacket. I don't got a URL hat. They ain't never bought shit for me. They ain't never done shit for me. So it's like, I'm only here for the battles. I don't care about what y'all got going on, and I got to stand over here and wave this flag for an army that won't even fucking pay me. So I knew for a fact, like, it's not for me. Like, that whole clicky-clicky shit, it ain't for me. And that's why I said, I don't personally need, or we don't personally need anything from other any of these leagues but to drop battles. That's the only thing we need you to do. Have cards, drop battles. I don't need, we don't need to be affiliated. We don't need to be in the crews and the clicks. The battle rap click shit is corny anyway. It really is. It's really getting played out. The battle rap crew shit is getting played out. Most of these niggas do not grow up around each other. They did not grow up around each other. They don't barely even hang out unless it's at an event. Like I said, a lot of the battle rap shit has become a friendly, friendly traveling circus where they're battling New Orleans one week, five weeks from now we're in Atlanta, Six weeks from now, we're going to take the whole party to Houston. Uh, uh, four months from now, we're going to go to Cali. And it's the same people going everywhere together. They help each other, right? They make sure, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is what happens. So, if you're not on URL for easy, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, number one was, you know, URL was no longer, they was no longer able to publicly support Easy to Block Captain. You know what I'm saying? These are the five reasons why. We can do five reasons why. Easy to block captain did not need gun titles or URL no more. Number one, URL, their artists, their media, their legal, we're not able to publicly support him anymore. We're not gonna, <laughs> we're not gonna cut the cake on this. Yeah, they could talk about their event. Yeah, they'll recap it. Yeah, they'll do shit like that, but publicly support it, it's just not gonna happen because you've chose your side of the street. And there's nothing wrong with people. People do that every day. They choose where they're gonna be and they just, you know, align their alliances to it. I've seen it happen before. I've been told, why are you going to op events? Why? And I never, I was never uh, just fold and do what you asked me to do, especially when I'm not getting no money with you. It's like they want you on their side and you ain't going to get no money with them. I don't What kind of shit is it? What these niggas be down for? These niggas be down for free. Me, I need a fee or I can't be, so I got to go. But they, that, that's what they need. They, 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 they lack people that's in the corner. So they, number one, they can no longer publicly support Easy to Black Captain. Period. I don't give a fuck what none of them say over there. They could not support him. That's it. Um, Rock and Surf, the leaders of gun titles, they got different deals. Their deal was not easy to block Captain's deal. I understand for the situation or whatever the case may be. Surf has like a per battle deal. And he'll tell you, I'm getting 50, I'm getting 60. He had no problem telling you how much money he was getting and he was not in no situation. He was doing per fucking four years or five years. Surf was not signed for five years or six. Rock is not signed for four, five, six years. Chess is not signed on one of them fucking 360 slave deals where you got 
five years with an option for six and no guaranteed money. Boy, so that no situation is all different. Boy, of no course way, you bro. can stay loyal to somebody when Boy, no only way, time bro. I'm signing the contract with you is if they call me, hey, we want you to take Calico on Summer Madness. We got 30000 Oh, and for Surf, that's not even enough. You got to raise the price, 50, 60, 70. Well, of course he's going to be loyal to that brand. He's getting signed per battle. That easy on a deal for five years. It's a totally different situation. So I said, Reason number two, y'all were not on six-year deals with no guaranteed money that say you can't battle anywhere when we don't want you to. That was not y'all's situation. Now, y'all was in situations that were so great that you could continue to battle on URL and you didn't need to go other places. There are a lot of artists that have been down with URL for all of these years and these niggas barely get booked. They barely get booked. They, like, I could name like three or four niggas right now. You'd be like, where the hell are they at? When the last time we seen Chilla Jones? Hmm? They don't book the dudes like Glue Easies and Riders. These niggas don't be getting booked. They've been down for years and years, and they can't go to Smack and be like, I want to be on the next volume. So is the situation even advantageous? If you're not a superstar or up there or like that, you're going to be stuck in the stuck in the mill. You think Saga could go ask them to be on the next volume and they put them on there? I can name like 10 niggas who would not, they, would, they probably would not put on a volume card. So the situation is not even advantageous to you because... If you wind up going and saying, you know what, I'm going to get some money over here. Remy calling him with more money than he ever made in his life from Battle Rap. On your league included. And he's supposed to turn that down for what? To be on the next volume? To be on... <laughs> Why did you, you foolish for thinking that he was going to turn down that money? Tell them niggas who told him to turn down that money, would they tell their own sons to turn down that money? Because I know the answer. The answer is hell no. <laughs> So I'm not mad. I was never mad at him for leaving. I'm never mad. That man was buying a house. And they was trying to tell him, don't go get the money. I know it because I was told by niggas, don't do this. Don't do that. Don't record on your own channel. Don't. But all of the while, they not paying you. Fuck that. Y'all got it. I'm good. Say whatever you want about me, but I'm going to be right over here doing this. And this took me to where we at. I remember, and I'll tell you, I'll tell you at the end. Fuck that. Um, so yeah. Number two, y'all were not on six-year deals with no guaranteed money that say you cannot battle anywhere you want to. When, when, when it, that, they weren't on that. Number three, battle rap crews are not gangs. It was a clout move for all parties involved. That shit was a clout move. Battle rap crews are not gangs. This is not the streets. The whole gang, gang, bang, bang. This is not a gang. Do you expect niggas to live by gang principles? Like... And when you when you join a battle rap crew, I don't expect people to like lay down and die for it, regardless of what the situation is. It is a battle rap crew. There are people who have been in multiple battle rap crews. Last time I checked, Av was in Cave Gang. Av is now in EFB. There's other artists who have been in different crews. They do not, and these niggas don't even. I said it earlier. They don't even live near each other. Do you expect someone to put their whole livelihood at risk? for a battle rap crew. That sounds crazy. So yeah, battle rap crews are not gangs. It was a clout move for all parties involved. Easy was one of the hottest artists at the time, so they went after him and put him down. And, you know, I think he started getting down when him and Rock did the two on two or whatever the case may be. Now, you know, Easy said that. He was like, yo, he didn't want him to join no crew, et cetera, et cetera. But he joined because his clout was at an all-time high. Gun titles clout. Surf says it in the joint yesterday. We go get someone. We know they're not going to be around for a long time. Woody, woody, woody. So you can't speak from the perspective of we get people knowing they're not going to be around. We knew it was going to happen. Know it's going to happen. And then when it happens, be surprised. You cannot. You can't be surprised. Like, if you knew he was going to leave anyway, then what's the big deal? You know what I mean? That's another reason. You know what I mean? Like, battle rap crews are not gangs. I'm sorry. It's not a gang. It's not. It's just a bunch of niggas that help you write and y'all hang out at events and take pictures together, smoke weed, and go home. That's a battle rap crew. That's it. If you're down five bands, can you call a nigga in a battle rap crew and be like, yo, I need five bands till the first. I got to pay with the wood wood. You might be able to, but I doubt it. Not for most of these dudes, because most of these dudes ain't got five bands to spend. We just seen Danny Myers have to wait to, like, fucking act the event to give Easy the Block Captain his damn money back. We literally saw that. Oh, I got to wait. Oh, da, 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 the check, the check, the check, the check. He backed off the trenches card to go on Miss Hustle's card, have one of the worst battles up there, lose to Luke Castro and Jerry West, and get clowned by his own. This is what I'm, This is another reason why I say battle rap crews ain't, they ain't, they ain't like that. Miss Hustle's on Danny Myers' team in EFB and 2-on-2, two two, and she still threw him under the bus. 
Didn't even get home. I don't even, like I said, I doubt she was even made it back to the crib before she threw him under the bus, my nigga. Would you throw somebody in your real crew or your real squad from home or from your block? You're not going to do that to them. It's just a clout move. Battle rap crews, that's it. It's just clout, period. And then they start adding all these other extra new niggas and niggas that's not even on URL and all that. Nobody, listen, nobody, nobody's tripping on no battle rap crew. Hey, this is number four. Easy was gonna move around regardless. He never struck me as an artist who wanted to be one of Smack's gunners. He never struck me as that. From the beginning, he always had a plan. He never wanted to battle on, on the app only. He only wanted to be on Cafe. He only wanted major stages. He only wanted YouTube. Why? He wanted the clout. That's what he wanted. He didn't want to be in the mill. Oh, we'll throw you on Civil War. Oh, we'll bring you back on this little car. He never battled on Civil Wars. He never battled on none of these super fight small cards because he knew what he wanted. Like I said, he never struck me as a person who was going to be in Smack's pocket and want to be Smack Gunner and gang, gang, gang and family for life and all of this shit. He looked at it as a business because he came in older, right? That's reason number five. And the final reason is he was already on TV. If you're cooking, they booking. He can get booked. He does not need a battle rap crew, especially one that cannot publicly support him anymore. I'm sorry, you know? I don't got no dog in the fight. I really don't care if Sue Surf says something. I spoke on what Rock spoke about it. I spoke on it when Surf spoke about it. And now speaking on it that Easy has replied in his, in his joint yesterday at Rosenberg Raw. You gotta remember, I don't give a fuck. I'ma say what gets paid. That's it. That's the only, that, that's it. You know what I mean? Like, I, and this, uh, hopefully they go on and do their own thing, but I don't see Easy as tripping. He had a good event. He was trending. They mentioned him in every single battle that happened this weekend. And they're going to probably mention him on every single card. You know what I'm saying? We could see it play out. You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to be one of them artists that take the easy way out. Everybody's got a bar. You know what I'm saying? Pull out the booth and the clip. Three is spray out. We're going to see it play out. I done done a lot of things, but I ain't never took the easy way out. You know what I mean? And I'm going to do a blog on... um. I'm gonna beat out soon, because I see a lot of people talking about beat out with beat out his third round versus Emerson Kenny Baruda. I would do a blog on him and what's going on with him and what I've gathered, you know what I'm saying? We'll do another one, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to the lunchtime gang, but uh, yeah, in battle rap, you gotta get your own clout. It's all about clout is everything. People can say what they want, but clout is everything. Two people could talk about the same subject, one, they're gonna watch one person more than the other because the other person got more clout. And uh, I'll leave with this one. I remember I was on the phone one time, right? It was me, P, and someone else, right? And the person was like, yo, why I don't use, you know, Vida voice, you know what I'm saying? Put him in the yada yada. You know what he told me? He said I wasn't important enough. That's what he said. If I'm lying, I'm flying. It's no diss to you. It is what it is. Um, I, you know, I kind of got off that. I see Verb is on it every day and all these other people are trying to burn him down every day. He's done some good things. I, I don't know recently, but whatever. He told me I wasn't important enough. Now, at the time, did I, did I agree with it? I was like, you know, it, I didn't, it, it didn't register with me well, because I'm like, damn, if a nigga that I really fuck with that want to see me win and got a position to put you in one says you're not important enough, he don't really fuck with you like that. And that was cool, but he didn't know that that was the motivation that I needed. So now I'm probably one of the most important bloggers ever, and he can't do anything about that, you know what I'm saying? But if he could, at the time, when he was like, yo, we don't want you recording on your own channel, we don't want you doing that. When they put all these controlling measures in form, if you follow and agree with it, who knows? I probably wouldn't be shit right now. I'd be just one of them little niggas, you know what I'm saying? Not, not saying no disrespect to nobody, but I would just be under a nigga wing, and I didn't want that. I wanted more for myself. So he never realized that I still, even to this day, that's one of the things I do remember when a nigga told me I wasn't important enough. Well, nigga, am I now? <laughs>
Yeah, that's why I'd be happy with my situation. I'm like, bro, I got where I got. I didn't need them niggas. I don't use them. I don't need them. The only thing we need y'all to do is drop battles. Nothing else. It's not a lot of us that's like that. But motherfucker, I'm one. Go on. This long distance, like T-Mobile Y'all on that sprint shit, don't make me pull up the niggas you dip with Get a casket, see if you can fit in this house, it's gon' work out huh? When the homies don't want me to murk out They don't dumb shit as soon as the word out I like got food bread, comes all these birds out If you gas wars, then I swerve out uh, The nerve of these niggas make me nervous A nigga knock a nerve out uh. yeah. Trouble, 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 trouble Trouble, 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 trouble.